This is Jen Lasser with Adobe Analytics Product Management. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate some new data source improvements we've made to freeform tables and cohort tables. So we've previously recorded a video on the updates we made to data source management from the visuals themselves. Things like summary numbers, line charts, what have you. If you click on any of the, the top left um, dots or, or locks to get to the data source settings, you'll notice that we've updated this uh, pretty recently. So we have a separate video on that. I'll include that in the description. Um, what I wanted to highlight, though, is improvements we've made to the data source management for tables themselves. So today, when you click this dot, it doesn't um, show you anything. Um, so what we've added is the ability to click this dot and see all the visualizations that are linked to a particular source table. You'll notice that the color of pink is carried throughout the source table and all of the linked visualizations as well. We can go ahead and highlight each linked visualization and it will hover and highlight over the, the visualization that is uh, linked to. So as I move through here, you'll see different visualizations are highlighted. If I click on any one of these, it will also jump the window down to that visualization just in case it's off the page when you're hovering over it. The other thing we've added is the ability to hide the source table itself um, from the table. So you can simply uncheck this box and the table will be hidden. Um, if you need to get it back again, you can go to any one of the linked visualizations and choose to show the data source. So we're hoping that these updates make it even easier for you guys to manage your visualizations and the data sources that are powering them.